Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Role Play Skyrim. We're watching, uh, what's his face, float down for this mission to Inchardak we're going on. Um, I recognize I am slightly tired. That's not perfect. But, I'm anticipating that we'll be able to make it work, somehow, some way. Either we'll be exhausted when we finish it, or we'll find some way to sleep. What's our next move? Oh, right, Teldrin's with us too. Teldrin and Dargo. Uh, and Master Nailoth. I hope this is important. Yes, where are we headed? The Chardak, an ancient Dwemer city on the eastern side of Solstein. It's largely flooded now, but luckily the main library is still above the water. Ah. It seems the dwarves were as interested in the Black Books as we are. They seem to have believed this one to be particularly valuable as it is secured in a mechanism which I have been unable to open yet. Right. Okay. Let me let's we can we can ask all this other stuff. But first Let's be on our way then. He's following me, so I guess we have three followers then? Where's Dargo? Where is Dargo? Hang on. Let me just make sure. I just want to make sure. Heart bones? There we go. Okay. Make sense. I'll just ignore that part. Okay, let's see. Where are we? I mean, he said where we're going, but let's... What does the map say? Kagrimez. And Chardak. Okay. Got it. Well closer we stay to the coast, the better, I'm assuming. That would be... It would be right over here. That's it, right there, right? That's gotta be it. Also, as soon as we get some starlight, which we... I don't know if we're gonna get it. Hello, Reeklings. I'm your chief. I'm presuming this is all okay. I don't know if we're gonna get some before we go inside, but if we do, I'll level up, because we are now, I think, level... 43 or 44, I can't recall which. Okay, that's not encouraging. Why is There's no one behind me? Did you guys hear that? I think I heard that. It's like a low rumbly sound, and then it sounded like maybe you and... Someone crying out. Try to see what that is over there. I'm betting it's a reaver, but let's get closer and find out. This would be it. Nordic arrow. Okay. They're just gonna line up. Whoops. <laughs> That's what boots would look mighty fine. <laughs> um, I don't want to use my silver arrows. Of course, everything else is pretty fantastic. Hmm. Use this one glass arrow. I'm being targeted. Yep. Nope. Damn. Um. Sure. Oh, hello. I search that guy. Is there Teldrin? We don't know what we're dealing with up here. rings he had on him. Malachi. 
Malakath. We're we're friends with Malakath, dude. Pretty good terms anyway. What? Who's hitting him with frost damage? Oh! Wow, what a chicken. Somebody was hitting Teldrin with frost damage, and I'm not sure who. Ah. Somebody over there. This guy. <laughs> who also got in the water. What a bunch of turkeys. Staffs of zombies, huh? Okay, so where did that dude go now? Dang. Maybe I could have timed that better. Okay. She's like, look, I'm between a rock and a hard place. I'm jumping in. <laughs> All right. It's an interesting place to camp. It's not on level ground, so I would think that, that would drive you a little bit crazy. Oh, I was gonna kill you, but you're you're Master Naloth. Getting him? He's working on it. <laughs> this Reekling's joining us too, apparently. It's hard. It's they're in the water, I guess. Nah, you're dead. Good, good fireball though. That was well done. You got me. Oh, would you shut up and get out of the water? You <laughs> ah, that was good. Ten Teldrin is a, he's a good shot. And all he did was just, he heard the guy and he's like, oh, I know exactly where you are. And then he set him on fire. That was perfect. Hello. You're going to stand there. Yeah, that did it. Oh, look, we do have starlight. Okay. No. In fact, if I can loot this guy, I will gladly give you, um, of course it's heavy armor. I don't know if what he's got qualifies as heavy armor. Tell him. Um, let's take it and go see. By the way. Um, yeah, Teldrin, I, I will gladly sh share with you. Yes. Where is Teldrin? Oh, they're coming up behind me. I don't know where Dargo is. He doesn't like that we're dealing with more people, I guess. What's our next move? Um... Trade some things? If it'll help us get moving quicker, sure. I don't know if what he's got is heavy armor or not. But let's try it. Here. Will you put this on? Oh yeah, he likes it. Except... <laughs> Except he doesn't want to change his helmet. <laughs> Alright, well... Let's go with it for a little bit. He just really likes that helmet. But we're gonna level up because we've got Starlight. Um, my 
God, our stamina would be 570. Let's take health then. And with four perks to increase, I think I'm probably going to end up saving them all again because I don't think anything new is unlocked since the last time we came and looked at all this. It's crazy that my two-handed is higher than my one-handed. This could take flurry. That would make me technically faster. I've been leaving that one because there's a chance that it might only apply to two-handed weapon, uh, to, you know, Florentine style, dual wielding. But, I don't, I think it does apply to everything. So, yeah, I'll probably use it on that. Agile spellcasting, that doesn't help me at all. Nothing new in sneak, nothing new in lockpicking. Nothing new in pickpocket. Speech, uh, we know it's in speech, and it doesn't appeal. So, yeah. I'll use one for... Where was it? Shit. One hand. Right here. What's this one? Alright, oh, that's dual wielding. Oh, I might be able to take two. I could. One hand weapons you're able to attack even faster. I mean, I'm already so fast. Let's see, this unlocks at 60, this unlocks at 60. I'd like to have those two when they unlock, and then... This isn't until 75. And 75. Hmm. Hmm. That's not till 75, and that's not till 75. Well... As long as I have two points for those marksmanship ones when they get to 60, I think I'm fine with using another point for this. And let's just see if that makes us freaking super fast. Oops. Make sure everything's good. So I take this out and go. What's our next move? <laughs> I don't know, that seems exactly like what it was like before, but... Now I can pretend like this is actually what it should have been all this time, because maybe it was bugged out or modded or something. Okay. Well, Teldrin, you've got new outfits. Uh, a new outfit. Dargo is MIA. Just seeing what's around... Okay, we're going in. The Dwemer of Nachardak appear to have been fond of these control pedestals. Luckily, I found a cube to operate it inside on my last visit. Oh, I sealed how did you get in? When I left to keep out ignorant meddlers, let me unlock it. Mm. The book is just inside. So we don't have to go very far? Wow, I thought it was going to be a whole thing. So tantalizingly close. Yes. Trust me, no magic will open that. I'd have had the book already if it could. No, we'll have to do this the hard way. Oh. If we can restore the steam supply to this room, I'm certain I can open it. As you'll see, that said than done. This way to the boilers. Ah. Me. Yes, we've done that before. So presumably we need steam to be able to activate this. That's what he was saying. And that way is not a traversable way. Where the hell is Dargo? What's our next move? I had no idea why he would be doing that. <laughs> uh, let's ignore it for now. That's a little odd. Mm. 
The last time I was here, I only explored a small part of the ruins. I was here alone then, and I find an assistant is absolutely essential for this kind of dirty, dangerous work. Yes. Well, my regular assistant is missing. Good thing I've got Teldrin. I don't know what he got up his ass. Not Teldrin. Uh, Who's there? Darga. So you chose today. Oh, they're dwarven, dwarven spears now. They don't exactly die. <laughs> the Reeklings came in. <laughs> Keep talking, dude. I'm listening. Ladies gave up. I have my doubt. But the city was a marvel of time. But engineering now reduced to this. If these little guys want to follow me around, that's totally fine. Hope we don't run into too many ash spawn down here. Down here? I don't think that's a that's a risk. As you can see, most of the lower levels of the city are flooded, but it isn't hopeless. The old Dwemer pumps still seem to work. Watch. But the pumps only operate when a cube is in the pedestal. Unfortunately, they only have one cube. These four boilers provide steam to the room upstairs. They're shut down, but they still respond to the control cubes. Okay. So... If we can find four more cubes, we can turn these boilers back on and restore steam power to the room upstairs. Then I should be able to open the book's protective case. Bring that cube. We'll need it. This one. Why didn't you take it, you goofball? Now oh, the water's filling back up. Right, okay. Yes, here we are. This device shows the location of four more cubes in this section of the city. It looks like most of the cubes were moved to the lower levels, perhaps to try to control the flooding before the city was abandoned. Hmm. Interesting. That would suggest that the city must have originally sunk during the first cataclysm of Red Mountain. Or that the Dwemer's servitors continued to try to preserve the city after their creator's disappearance. Hmm. Three of the cubes are through here. This yeah. seems like a sensible place to start. Right, and I you do should this. Be able to unseal this door with the control cube I gave you. Better say it. Oh, and we're level forty-four. It looks like. Uh-oh, we left uh, Nailath alone. I'm sure he'll be fine. Let's see a master at work. Yep, he's good. <laughs> Here they come. I hope the rest of the cubes are this easy to find. But knowing the Dwemer, I'd rather doubt it. Keep going. Assuming we keep going. Oh, yep, yeah, we do. Look. Summons, even. Wow. Oh, wait, that's Teldrin summons. This is here un uh, looted, but oh god, I'll take it. Shit! Oh, do, oh. whoa! Hang on, I'm trying to find my way out of here. 
Are you talking to me? Must be the great workshops of the Chardak. Impressive, even in ruins. In the city's days there we go. of glory, it was reputed to be able to assemble a complete automaton in a single day. Much of the time, a single day. The of Red Mountain must have come from here. Hmm. Okay, so I need to provide to control pet. Oh my god, I hope these things don't come to life. It looks like we'll need to lower the water level. Yes, to two control cubes, progress. I think. I'm glad that I'm finally traveling with someone who seems competent. My last patron was killed trying to tackle an entire fort of bandits alone. Oh. Doesn't encourage me, honestly. Oh, good. Now we can see if we can find a way to get that next cure. What say... Whoa! Alright. I was going to say, what say you, Naloth? And then he just... Just jumped. Hmm... God, so much loot. Can't stand it. Teldrin, uh, between you, me, and Dargo, we're gonna be able to retire after this. Holy shit. After, you know, after Solstheim, I mean. So what are you discovering here, Sir Nailoff? Anything of value? I'm... Hello. I'm not seeing any cubes. I'm seeing a thing that wants a cube. Can't go that way. Right, jump up here. Yeah, not quite. Holy shit! Wow. Surprise the hell out of me. Nope, that's just stationary. Just taking, not taking any chances here. Ah. We have space for another control cube. How the hell do I get there? I don't think Whirlwind Sprint would be enough to get me over- OW! I don't think Whirlwind Sprint would be enough to get me this distance. Because I would just use that. Maybe I need to talk to... Naloth. Where is he? There you are. What do you know? I think we should focus on how to get up to the door on the north side of the workshop. North side. We still have two. Do we think that if we take the cubes, the pumps will continue to work? Now that it's pumped the water out, do we need to worry about it? Let's just take one and see what happens. Okay. A modest amount of water. Ah! I didn't even notice you there, you asshole. Ow, I didn't notice you either. <laughs> I'm bad at this. Nailoth's probably not very impressed. Put one here. Yes, perfect. What happens if I take the other one? The water probably refills, but I don't care if I've got the stairs. Teldrin, I think you're swimming now, but... That's probably just fine. 
Hello. Can I take this? I don't have that one's not there anymore. Well, I'm sure it's fine. <clears throat> Let's keep going in the way that we've discovered we can keep going. Oh ho ho! Ow. It does hurt. They are frequently they're they're getting more easy to kill. But it does still hurt. drink. Man, I get thirsty fast out here. Must be all the ash. Oh, and I'm tired now. Mm, I'd have to get someone to bring this to my lab. What, the spider? Ah, maybe this is the way we go? The other cube. Yes, of course. Unfortunately, each cube we retrieve. I think they may be rebuilding the while we're not done. <laughs> yeah. Oh, crap! I'm counting on more water. Does this get me to another door? Whoa! It does get me to another door? I don't know where Teldrin is now. Let's see where this leads. Oh, right, and the one restoration perk. I was saving for that, too. That's right, I forgot. Shit! Um. My clothes are going to be soaked. <laughs> You are, dude. That looks conspicuous. I don't want that thing hitting me, whatever it is. 